Alrighty, today's free to play quest is going to be Let Them Eat Pie. So there's going to be no level requirements, no items needed, and it's right next to the Taverly Lodestone. So I don't have to show you the map for this one. So talk to the merchant and start the quest. See, there's a merchant upstairs. I need something to lift him from. I do it myself. But I'm more into the legitimate document business these days. <laughs> Keep your voice down. Look, he's not a very nice bloke, right? He's a road under stout, and he's currently buying up all the food in the area on the cheap and selling it to the refugees in a huge mob. Just listen, Booya. All I need is a seal. I'm a forged letter, and if I can get his personal seal, and I can get his associates to open the stockpiles to the people of the town. Are you in or not? Well, Rolo isn't cool every day. He orders some fancy pie from the... So, what we'll do is make up a pie that'll put him out of commit... Not poison poison. Just something that will put him in the infirmary for a while. Nah. He has it in a chest up there by his table, in case any if he's rushed off to hawk his guts. Exactly. So what I need you to do first is take care of the most comp... What we're going to do is mix in a load of fishing bait into the flour. Do you know about the water mill to the south? What you can get wheat from a field to the south of here? Upstairs, there is a hop. Once you've done that, use the lever nearby to put it all in the mill. Now go back downstairs and use your pot to gather up the flour and bring it to me. If you don't have a pot on you, why not go see Mess Sergeant Ramsey in the tavern there? He's probably got one you can have for free in that shop of his. Or you can just make them for free, if you can. Okay, see you about. Alright, so the first item we're going to need some maggoty flour. So run south across the bridge right here, pick up some fishing bait, and then go to the wheat field and pick some wheat. And when you have that in your inventory, just run to this first building in the north. And we're just going to add the wheat to the compressor thing on the second floor. And it's automatically going to add in the fishing bait. So head downstairs after you operate the lever and click on the flower and it's going to be in your inventory. After that, talk to the merchant again to give him the maggoty flower and then he's going to give you the next task. That's perfect. Don't worry. I'll take care of making this into a pie shell for you in a moment. What we need first is a raw crayfish. Just shove it right into the dirt and then let it. Just use either the flax field, wheat field, or the animal pen for the job. The flax field is closest. It's in the northwest, and don't forget, when you are done, you should come and see me and show me you first. Let me take care. Okay. So the next item he requires is a manky crayfish. See this uh, guy right here by the pond? You can fish right there to get the crayfish. And then when you have that in your inventory, just head into this farming area and a little cutscene is going to happen where you're going to get the manky crayfish. After you have that, return to the merchant for the next, next task. How are the fish biting? Oh, Saratomin, that thing stinks. Perfect. 
Huh? To give the pie a little more body, we'll add a potato. I want you to go and get a raw potato and cabbage burrows are full of hair and droppings and all other kinds of nasty waste. So if you just shovel us, say okay. The next item he needs is a stinking potato. So if you planted any potatoes, you can just pick one from there, or just trade the merchant and buy a normal potato from him. And after that, you're going to want to run to the Kebet area. You see that little winter on the north west side of my map. So when you're up here, use the potato right on there, get this stinky potato, and run back to the merchant. Oop, actually you're just supposed to cook it. Sorry about that. So cook it at the range, then go back to the merchant. something to master. I have an idea though. One of Rolo's fellow merchants, Foppish Pierre, and he carries a supply of spices on him all the time. So just go and grab those spices from So now we need some expensive spices. So run south and you're gonna see Foppish Pierre. And we're just gonna pickpocket him. Oh, are you dressed? Oh, so this can take up to anywhere from like five to ten chances so then don't get discouraged if you don't get the spices right away just after you get the spices is automatically adds to the pie and now we're gonna run upstairs Watch me. so talk to the really heavy guy and you're gonna give him the pie, he's gonna eat it and get sick. So just watch the cutscene. What is this? This is not the scrumptious red berry in this. Well, that's not my problem. Maybe he didn't torment the quails for as long as I specified. But whatever this is, it does. Oh, really? What is it called? A crayfish a la mank? I can't say I've ever... To make up for not being able to make the pie I ordered. Well, that's quite nice of you. To tell the chef I will only sue him slightly for not making And that if this pie tastes nice. Thanks. Yes, yes, that's all very well and good. Now be on you. A crayfish a la mank, So after the cutscene, you're just gonna go upstairs, back to that room, and search the chest right where that guy was sitting, and then you return to the merchant one more time to finish it up. You're gonna get one quest point, 100 cooking XP, 150 thieving experience. 
some spice pouches, five meat pies, and two treasure hunter keys. If you made it this far, please give this video a like. And I'll see you next video. I saw it. I saw all of it. You don't know. You'll never know what I saw. The colors. All the colors. And sometimes none of the colors. The darkness came to me then. With the stench. It protected my mind. But the darkness is still there. The smell of Bell of it will never, ever, until you, or the gods themselves wept. No, don't leave. Great. Done. Now don't forget the cup. Don't joke around with me. You... What madness is... I... Well, looks like it's all thanks to you. There is that. Good point, but...